Namaste, motherfucker. Hey, thanks for coming to check us out today here at New York Eternix. Today we are doing another video for the recipe series. We are making deep fried quail in the fryer later in the kitchen. It's going to be dope as always. Come check it out. It's only a little bit of salt left in here, so I'm going to sprinkle it around. And as always, we're going to use some pepper. And adobo. stuff in there and a little more this way you don't get your hands all messy the mix is just as well I mean if you want to get your hands in there great you know you have that option it's usually what I do but I have to operate this camera I walk back and forth do all this and that so I'm choosing to do it this way Right, and once you have your food seasoned pretty much to your satisfaction, what I like to do is add a little bit of mustard. Glad my counter's clean. Now, even if you don't like mustard, this isn't something that really comes out as a flavor in the recipe. Well, not the mustard flavor, at least. It does create a flavor, but I don't know. I find it pretty nice. I am a mustard fan myself, but again, you don't have to get mustard involved. There's no need for it. All right. So while that's marinating in there, we're going to go ahead and get these eggs out. Start cracking those. All right, so I dumped, dumped them out, put them in a bowl to make them a little bit easier to work with. Go ahead and get these cracked.
All right, so that's 12 eggs. And one more for good luck. All right, I'm gonna whip them up. All right, in the meantime, we've got our fryer later. We've got it nice and clean. We're going to get it full of oil. We're going to get started. All right, so we've got some flour in here. We've got our egg over here. I'm gonna do an egg wash. I'm gonna get the quail put in here while we're waiting on this to heat up again. Just get it prepped out. So I'm working with limited space. Make sure you drip off any excess egg on there. right into the flour. Again, dripping off all the excess egg. There's a lot of it on there. <clears throat> Seems like when you use quail egg, it's extra thick. So, get all of that going. Make sure you're covered. I'm gonna take your quail out, put it to the side. into the flour. All right, set them aside. All right, then we're almost done with this part. I just heard the tick on the fry later, so. All right, so it looks like we're ready to get this in the fry later. Quail in. Put a few into the basket at one time. Well, let's go with five. Why not? Starting to look good. All right, folks, and there we have it. Deep fried quail straight out of the fry later at home. If you have any recipes you want to share, make sure you do that below. I'll be looking forward to it. 
And I'd like to thank you once again for coming to check us out here today at New York Eternics. If you have any questions or comments, or if you want to share a recipe, feel free to do so below. Also, leave a like for the video and please subscribe to the channel for more. We're always coming back with more videos and we just hit a thousand subscribers and I'd like to thank you all. Again, thank you from New York Eternics. I look forward to seeing you soon. Thank mm -hmm. you.